I guess I'm the only one at Deutsche Horn at the moment. <clears throat> Do you believe that that train that just took off was a 150? Um, well, it is 150. 253, I think it was. I'm not 100% sure. Um, I also did forget yesterday we were at Exmouth <laughs> looking at model trains and walking around the town. The train broke down. And we had to get the bus back to Exeter. As a 165 or 166, it's first Great Western delivery one. I'm not sure it's running today. But I was on the class 43 today from Plymouth to Newton Abbott. And it had a class 43 40 years of service, which is quite some time ago. But I suppose in, because it's coming up to 50 years of service now, they're going to have to do something special for that one. This is the next big one for them. <clears throat> Hopefully we'll keep running until at least in the 50 years so it will be worth it and get the old, old liveries back out. <clears throat> and I will be quiet when trains are due to go through but that one's just sitting there at the moment so it's fine. We've got a lot of fast things one coming from platform one or two, or I can't remember. Platform one. So on platform one. Yeah, I'm expecting there should be a fast move one to platform one. Anything in the next ten minutes. I'll be back in, when I next see a train.
<coughs> and I got a voyager to Plymouth. Two two one or two 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 voyager cost can to that. <clears throat> Ain't got a javelin coming towards us. Class 800. Has the they know the best looking trains. It looks like a bit like a sausage to me. No. Are you coming in? I think we're going super slow. Class 800 805 on the rear of that one. I think that's the thunder it though. So class 800 05 on the back. Class 800 javelin. The first before the ice teas apparently. The ice teas are in Germany. We got another Voyager two two one or two two two. 
cross country border and from uh, from Edinburgh to Plymouth. I mean, this one is. Hmm. It's a big one, too. <clears throat> you know another two two one supervisor in cross country probably down to Edinburgh. Some do go further in Edinburgh. Another train comes through. Oh, seems like another jumping. Gotta be uh, London Pantin to Plymouth. Oh, it's not a job, then. <laughs> It's a turbo. Was trained to Paynton. Hmm. One of those trains yesterday. Sixty six uh one six six zero five three it's the name of that number of the back of the train, that particular one. What coach is that? Coach. Still got the number one on the low guys. I don't understand why a cartoon trip is so popular at the moment.
Fifteen and zero two four four. I'll tell you a story. That's <laughs> a situation last Saturday. Um, I don't know if my father is still there. I'm guessing they haven't got the signal to go yet. I can see the reason why too. Someone's moving a lot faster. We've got a class 800 coming towards us this time. I'm actually right. <laughs> um, I'll tell you the story once it's gone through. Class 800, I think it was 095 or something on the back. I'm not 100% sure on that one. Right. Gonna cut it down and I'll come back in a second. That one's broken down like the yesterday one. I need to change the battery too. Both have gone red. Right. I mean, someone else is coming through. Turbo's just taking off. Saturday, um, when the bad weather hit, which wasn't until the afternoon, yeah. Obviously, my training up for Oakhampton was cancelled, so <laughs> kind of stressful situation. I got stuck 
I access David. So I have to come back. And I have to get back on a Edinburgh train to Plymouth. And that was like just five to eight in the evening, my Saturday. And I didn't get to Plymouth at all. Close to five to nine. So it was ridiculous because of the weather was because atrocious last weekend. Hope then it won't be like that next weekend. Well, tomorrow. Really hope, because <laughs> I don't want to go through doing that again. Hopefully, the world's behaving itself this weekend. I mean, I'm not just trying to get on the right train to go the right way, but also included with there's a special train coming through tomorrow afternoon, so definitely want it to be nice. See you guys in a couple of minutes for when the next train's due. I'm not totally sure which way it's coming this time. If we come from Exeter, it could be going towards Exeter. See you guys when I see the next train due to come through. Yeah, I've got a train coming in, but I'm not 100% sure what sort of train it is at this time. And yes, I had a train yesterday, me and my mum went out to Exmouth for half a day and uh, <laughs> it broke down. I was the one we were due to get on on the way back. It broke down, so it was stuck there quite some time. Um, so yeah, we had to went on the bus instead. <laughs> it's one of those things though, isn't it? I can honestly say GWRs, GWRs, not the most reliable train companies, train situations, but they need worse. Hmm. Huh. Quarter to seven. It takes a long time on you to head back. Can't be late though. I think what I can see, what sort of train could be, it could be a 150. Class 150, I'm not 100% sure. There it comes. It is a class 150. Hmm. Class 150 is a C1. Class 150. Suzo. Two two one at the back. That's a firm um, train wall. Well, that was not planned. On the side of the scene there. Um, what's that? So cargo or is it? No, it's a Voyager. Two two is a two 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 class cross country Voyager. Two 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 or two two one Super Voyager. Used to be owned by Virgin many years ago. Between 
the 90s and year 2000s before Pendolino took over them votes how many are the running today to bring such monster trains down George Warren sidings, I mean, they're huge, they're not suited to down those slide really, they're all on the outer lines, but on these stations they're just a little too small for them sort of things, besides, I think Cross Country HSTs and the Voyagers and possibly the Turbos and definitely Freight as well, are the best trains out of the javelins and the cars 150s and 158s they're a bit like ugly looking things the javelins and the 158s and 150s HT is the best second would be the voyages and then third probably would be the cargoes freight train 66 and of course you get a couple of special steam locomotives like A4 and the Midland Pullman HST sets, which is quite cool. Um, yeah, quite actually quite quiet evening. It's not too noisy like it was <laughs> the train I got onto from Newton Abbey down to Dawlish, that was pretty noisy. And obviously, oh, got a nice tea. <laughs> I'm just going to put this down. You seem to have a lot of iced teas running now. <clears throat> yeah, sad times. See these ones in sort of so much could be much nicer trains shame they're getting rid of excuse me it's a shame they're getting rid of all the HST sets even the castles one of the castles recently went um, went on a container boat out to somewhere aboard um, it got I think it's getting 
either getting a clean up ready for the 50 years of service in two years or in other words, across from 50 coming this way, very fast. It's not that fast, though. Get that way, because me, that's only 45 miles an hour. That's slow. Yeah, then you might just be all like 75. These things, I'm not sure. I think they could do a 300 and probably 300 miles an hour. Hill Tour or something on the back of that one. 800 165, I think. That one. Thanks. So, yeah. And as I say, just had a 150 taken off, and we just had a straight through Cars 800 152, I think it was, at the front. So, in Hall. Hill tour at the back. Didn't catch the name number on it though. Um, yeah, it was don't like the Jumpins or the 150s or the 158s. Definitely the HSTs, definitely. So yeah, that's what's I think that's the ones that saved Britain's rally back in the eighties. Either they've been privatized after being been British Railroad and the government decided to privatise everything. And I think, what was it, this year or last year, the government took over the railways again, so kind of completely screwed over the railway companies. So, so not many drivers and staff running them. Back in a few seconds, another train. Yep, yeah, we've got 221 Super Voyager in cross country, probably from Edinburgh to Plymouth. These are quite nice trains. There's not the money in London and there now. Yeah, that Twenty six seconds. He's yeah, definitely going fast. Probably running late. And I'll see you guys again in about five or ten minutes. 